Well, the sole survivor of a horrific murder-suicide near Clara's home is now back home in Prince Edward Island. Shana Conway said goodbye to friends in Calgary last night before flying home to her native PEI three months to the day after she was left for dead in a tragic roadside shooting near Clara's home. Now, last December, the 21-year-old was driving her friends Mitch McLean and Tanner Craswell to Calgary to fly home for Christmas in PEI. Her friend Tapa the Steppel went along for the ride. Police say Steppel's ex-boyfriend, Derek Jensen, forced their vehicle off the road. He shot all four of them before turning the gun on himself. Conway was the only survivor. She was shot in the thigh, stomach and shoulder that left her partially paralyzed. Conway told reporters in Charlottetown last night, movement is returning to her limbs. She was overwhelmed and extremely grateful, calling all the support that she's received just amazing. And she can't thank anybody enough. What do you even say? There's no words. Conway still requires a cane to walk. In January, a memorial was held for the shooting victims. Lethbridge's Prairie Baseball Academy has created scholarships to honor Tanner Craswell and Mitch McLean.